So I'm going to inform the public about Bonaire and their seven and a half ounce beer bottles. Um, they're everywhere. We go to the grocery store. Uh, a couple of the grocery stores, granted they're mom and pop shops, but they have nothing but the miniature Corona bottles and these like miniature polar bottles, which are from Venezuela, so they're probably brewed with dead cats. And the only people who need a seven and a half ounce beer is the designated driver, not the customer. This is this is an unforeseen thing that I didn't know I'd run into, but it's it's just not acceptable. So just stick to stick to the hard stuff. It's just worth your time. We take down the young branches from the mature cactus with this Bonarian tool. We tear them off and we let them fall on the ground. It's a tradition to keep a few of those young branches on the ground. They will regrow into new cacti. The peel that we take off, that's a protective layer, there's nothing in it. Underneath is a second green peel and the green peel has all colors and flavors that you want. Green peel will be placed in a special Bonarian drying chamber. It is a car, uh -huh. yes, yes. <laughs> Behind the windshield of a car in two days, the peel will be as dry as this. Oh my goodness. This is the raw material. In the kitchen of Bonaire, it will be ground up to a powder. And from this powder, you can make a soup, cactus soup. That's the original tradition of Bonaire. And that's why we use this local grain called sorghum, mini corn. We let this ferment on bubbles like that on the floor to an 18% alcohol. The process will take about two weeks and we use yeast. And if the mixture is ready, it goes into the big still for the first run. Second time in the small still and after two runs, you will have 80% pure alcohol, 160 proof. 80% two runs. We will distill a part of this for a third time again in that small still and then you go up to 95% pure alcohol. We use it to extract colors and flavors from the peel and in case of the Caduce liqueur, we use lime peel and the dry cactus peel. Beautiful green alcohol now and extraction for the lime will take about one month to get all colors and flavors in the alcohol. For the cacti it will take half a year. When they're ready, we will filter off these two alcohols and together with this grain alcohol will be the basis of the recipe. It goes into the big mixing tank. We had a number of secret ingredients, which of course I cannot tell, but after approval of the master distiller, we open the tap to the I Love Bunger bottle machine and we can start filling bottles, two at once. That's how we started 2009 with the Caduce of Bunger. And now we make liqueurs for all Dutch Caribbean islands based on the traditions of those islands. The kukui of Aruba made with a local cherry called the Shimaruku and roasted agave leaves. Kadushi of Bonaire cactus and lime, the one you tasted when you came in. This is the kalbash of Curaçao made from kalbash and sour salt. Windward Islands, Goldustasia made with guava and dried hibiscus flour. We have the spices of Saba. And then we should have made a liqueur for the island of St. Martin, the sixth Dutch island. But we couldn't find a tradition on that island where we could make a liqueur of, so no St. Martin liqueur. Instead, we made one for the Dutch kingdom. Uh -huh. Orange of Orange. We used the oranges for the king because he's from the House of Orange. And we added some yerba mate, that's an Argentina tea, for the Queen Maxima. She is originally from Argentina. And the king and queen were on this island. 2011, they tried this liquor and they took a bottle home. So we like to call it royal approval. Yeah. Why not? We also make four spirits. This is the spirit of Bonaire and we try to capture the spirit of Bonaire in a bottle with a Captain Don's whiskey. 
It's named after the founder of the diving industry on this island, Captain Dog. The biggest parent of them all. And it, this is the first and only Caribbean whiskey in the world. We looked at the big whiskies in the world and created our own recipe, aged on French oak with Cuban tobacco leaves in the barrel. Interesting whiskey. Kadushi vodka is a cactus vodka made with the Kadushi cactus. Smooth vodka, but with a spiny character, of course. Our tequila, made with local agave, but ladies, we also added Gabonarian aloe vera. Mm. Aloe vera is good for your skin. Drink it, don't rub it on your skin. <laughs> and we make a spiced rum. Rum Rincon. One of the ingredients in this rum is a wild basil called Yerba di Ole. And this is also aged on French oak. And we named this rum after the capital of Bonaire. Well, it should have been the capital of Bonaire. Rincon. So that's what we make. Any questions? Quite a selection. Look at that. Kabuchi vodka. Mm hmm. So, where are you from? $300 later. We bought all the liquor we wanted from Kadushi, but they recommended a restaurant because I thought they had uh, burgers and hot dogs here, but they do not. Um, there's a place up the hill that is where all the locals eat. They have iguana, goat, all that good stuff, so we're going to give that a try. That's kind of rare, having, you know, hills. We're going to go take a look at what they have on the menu. There's not a lot of people here, but everybody's kind of on the same schedule. We're just not on that schedule. That's just kind of how this island works. All right. I will have I feel like a is a sort of thing that I want to... Um, Experience the culture I want through. To I want to try, but not make the main thing. Anything catch your eye? Just started looking. Oh, okay. So I'll hit you up in about 45 minutes yeah. when you come up with a decision. You're so funny. We can yes. find out. Oh, yes, it's bony. It is bony. Mm. Delish. Mm. It is good. Next time I see an aquan, I can say, I ate from your kind. <laughs> Salt cold sandwich. That just simply means that I can have more. You have to weigh things out. It's all about weighing things out. And for me, I'd say that that's a thumbs up. You can smell it. Because it's the same. You can smell it. Close enough. Supper's ready. And in Amsterdam, I was able to have the pleasure, even though it was cold, 
It was blisteringly cold, but I was able to have this and a joint and this. He's going through his joint withdrawals right now. I'm having fun. Don't worry. Doing okay. Just, just 